Hello everyone. My name is Abhishek and welcome back to my channel. I'm here with a very exciting announcement. I'm going to do a free Linux course on this YouTube channel. So Linux Zero to Hero is going to be a five episode Linux series where I'm going to explain everything from the scratch. And the best part of it, all the five episodes will be released in seven days. From 14th of April to 20th of April, you will see me uploading all the five episodes of the Linux series. I could have done it from the next week, that is from 7th of April. However, we are currently doing AI assisted DevOps series. There are three episodes pending. So once we complete those three episodes, we will start doing this Linux Zero to Hero series. There are no prerequisites. Anybody can get started whether you are from development background, testing background, or DevOps engineering, you can get started with this series and you can master Linux. Once again, it's going to be available on this YouTube channel from 14th of April to 20th of April. Now let's see the course syllabus where I have already designed the course. Documentation will be shared with you as part of each episode. So I will be using this GitHub repository for documentation and also for sharing the useful resources with you. You can find the GitHub repository link in the description. Overall course is categorized into 10 sections. However, we will cover 10 sections in five episodes. Starting with fundamentals of Linux, where we will learn what is an operating system, what are different operating systems, structure of Linux operating system, and we will also learn how to run Linux on your machine. Then we will head to folder structure. By default, when you create a Linux machine, it comes up with various folders and also files. So we will learn what exactly are those folders and what files are in each folder. This is very important to know. Then we will learn about user management. So how do you create users? How do you remove users? How do you create groups? And what are important files to remember when it comes to user management? Similarly, we will learn about file management. So as a DevOps engineer or as a developer, you want to create files and you want to write data into the files. So this file management episode is going to help you with respect to that. We will learn about VI shortcuts. So we will learn what is VI editor, how to use it and important shortcuts to improve your efficiency with respect to VI. Then we will learn about file permissions. RBAC is very important and it's one of the advantages of Linux over Windows. So we will learn how you can grant file permissions and restrict access to the users. It's going to be very elaborated session. Then we will learn about process management. On your Linux machine, you might be running hundreds of processes. So we will learn how to do the process management, how to kill the processes, how to check for the running processes, and how to find processes that are consuming more resources. Then we will head to monitoring part. So monitoring tells you the state of your Linux system. So we will learn how you can figure out issues with your Linux system. You will learn how you can identify and debug your Linux system. Then we will head to networking. We have already done a lot of videos on Linux networking, right from IP address, CIDR, we covered concepts on AWS, Azure. So I will provide references to a lot of things in this video. And I will also cover the fundamentals of networking. Mostly we will learn what are the various commands that you can use to troubleshoot networking on the Linux system. Finally, we will learn about disk management. For example, on AWS or Azure, as a cloud engineer, how do you add the volumes? How do you remove the volumes? How do you mount the volumes? Typically, managing the volumes, that is the disk management. 
So we will learn that as part of day 10. Overall, we might cover more than 50 commands related to your Linux. Anyways, the most important point is we will learn Linux from scratch. I have already uploaded a lot of content to it. I'm preparing the GitHub repository with more documentation and more references. By the time we complete AI assisted DevOps series, that is next week. And when we start the Linux zero to hero series, you can find this GitHub repository completely ready. So if you want, you can start the repo and you can follow it. So this is the update about Linux zero to hero series. If you are excited about it, definitely let me know in the comment section and also please share it with your friends who are interested in learning Linux. See you all on 14th of April on the first class of Linux zero to hero. Until then, bye. Take care.